file uh, today we will see the mathematical derivation of uh, mass energy equivalence equation the famous equation of uh, Albert Einstein equals to mc square to start with we know that uh, work is force multiplied by distance you can also say that energy is force multiplied by distance we want to take the change in energy we can say that delta e is f dot ds force applied by the distance move in that mm -hmm. respect energy will be integral of f dot ds from newton we know that force is the rate of change of momentum where p is mass into velocity if we differentiate this equation force will be m dv by dt plus v dm by dt mm -hmm. considering this as uh, first equation and this as second equation if we put second equation to the first equation what we will get is energy as integral of instead of f we can write m dv by dt plus v dm by dt dot ds which can further be written as m dv ds by dt plus v dm ds by dt now we know that ds by dt is nothing but uh, velocity so we can write it as integral of m v dv plus v square dm because ds by dt is velocity for now let us consider this as equation 3 Now from relativity, relativity, we know that relativistic mass is m0 upon under root of 1 minus v square by c square. Now we can also write it as m0 1 minus v square by c square to the power 1 by 2. If we differentiate this equation with respect to velocity, then we will get dm by dv as m0 minus 1 by 2 1 minus v square by c square this will become minus 3 by 2 and now when we differentiate this term we will get minus 2v by c square this 2 and 2 will get cancelled minus and minus will become plus you will get m0 v by c square and for this term you can write it as 1 minus v square by c square 1 by 2 multiplied by 1 minus v square by c square minus 1 now if we but rearrange this term we will get dm by dv as v c square if I take this term here I will get 1 minus v square by c square then I will take the m here m0 and this term will become this term will become minus v square by c square now on solving this we will get v c square by c square c square minus v and this is nothing but this term is nothing but the relativistic mass so we can write dot m so the c and c got cancelled we are left with mv by c square by minus v square dm by dv uh, if we resolve this equation we will get c square dm as uh, c square dm minus let's cut this c square dm minus v square 
dm is equal to mv tv so you can rewrite this equation as c square dm as mv tv plus v square dm consider this equation as equation 4 Now if we put equation 4 to equation 3, since this term and this term are same, we can write energy as an integral of c square dm. As we know that speed of light is constant, so c square will remain like this and integral of dm from will become m c square and this is that famous equation e equals to m c square this is how mass and energy are related thanks